Hey everyone, it's Axel here from Axel Azuli Entertainment, and today I've got something new. This is my new information series called Interabang, and uh, blah, 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 blah. it is the first episode ever, and today we're well, on Interabang, it's a series about information, top ten lists, stories, stuff like that, and we do saying from the spectrum of FNOT, uh, FNOTS, F-N-O-T-T-S, facts. News, opinions, uh, trivia, theories, and stories. Uh, well, today, we'll be doing the T for theories and O for opinions. Uh, where we be at, uh, well, we'll be answering the question of why is our tube heroes one of the best ideas in recent years? Uh, and this uh, video was made uh, because the big YouTuber Proto Mario sent out a question when he was asking... Why do people like tube heroes? What's the thing that makes tube heroes cool? So I decided to answer that question. And if you're watching Proto Mario, just because I don't have a great mouse doesn't mean I uh, can't make intelligent content. Uh, bleh. So let's get started. Well, for the first thing, one, YouTubers are heroes. Uh, well, most people's heroes. Uh, a lot, most of my heroes are YouTubers. Uh, and who wouldn't want a thing, uh, uh, like an action figure of your hero? Uh, it's a pretty good idea. Uh, they've made them for pretty much everything. Remember, Miley Cyrus used to be super popular when she was Hannah Montana. And like every girl you'd go would have a, a, at least one Hannah Montana doll. It was weird, but that's how it works. If you, uh, you're, uh, if you have a hero, uh, you'd love to get merchandise for him. So that's point one. And two... Uh, well, the biggest point I'm going to address, this may sound a little crazy, but I'm going to compare this to the likes of Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles and G.I. Joe, like you had in your video, Proto Mario. And before all you go down to the comment section and start screaming at me, here's my, uh, here's my uh, justification. Why was Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles and G.I. Joe so popular? You watched them in their cartoons. They were heroes to you. Uh... They were pre uh, they were your heroes, uh, and so you wanted to act out their adventures. But you may ask, hey Axel, why? Sorry, my recording just cut out there for a second. Let me continue. Uh, why am I comparing these two YouTubers? Well, the answer is quite simple. Uh, Bleh, I keep losing my train of thought. This is my first time really doing this type of podcast type thing. Uh, so, uh, bear with me. Uh, YouTubers are kind of like Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles in the thing where you want to act out their adventures. Now, uh, I, uh, my proof for this is I would like to address mod, uh, custom mod adventures. As you may know, about a year ago, the whole craze on YouTube Minecrafty stuff was to do mod showcases, where you showed a mod, explained everything in that mod, how the mod worked, etc. Uh, well, this year, just about nobody still does those. Only a few YouTubers actually still do regular mod showcases, which I find kind of unfortunate. But it was replaced by something better, the custom mod adventure. Now, a custom mod adventure, uh, it's basically they take mods and they do like a story out of it. Uh, and usually they fight a villain and they save the world of Minecraft and stuff. So it's basically like they're making uh, like an animated video of uh, like a hero saving the world, but it's not animated. It's in Minecraft and it's with mods. Uh, so what I think about this is that that's very similar to Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles and G.I. Joe. How you watch your heroes save the world on uh, YouTube, and then you want to get their characters to act out their adventures. Uh, blah, 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 blah. Uh, yeah, my train of thought. I really need to like uh, get my train of thought on here. Okay, not going to get distracted anymore. Probably. This is completely unscripted, which is why I keep losing my train of thought. I don't have anything to, like, uh, uh, stare at and keep my train of thought on. Uh, but, yeah, you're acting out your hero's adventures. Uh, like, the Diamond Minecart has saved the world on multiple occasions in his mod showcases. Significantly, like, the order of the cookie, I believe it was. Uh, his one where he did a live uh, video at... Uh, 
that convinced him. I can, uh, can't remember which one, but it was where he saved the world from the evil scientist Denton, who was a reoccurring villain on his show. So, uh, uh, long story short, I'm comparing them to Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles and G.I. Joe because they go on cartoony adventures just like them, uh, which comes together to make people really like these. And do I have any? At this point, I do not have any tube heroes in the mo at this moment. Uh, uh, there's none, uh, well, there's very few of YouTubers I really like. Uh, most of them I haven't heard of, like you, Proto Mario. Uh, I like the Diamond Minecart. I love Atlanticraft. But they need to get some more YouTubers. They need to get Think Noodles and uh, uh, Popular MMOs. Uh, those two, I would buy those in a heartbeat, literally a heartbeat. I'd be like, they come out, I'd instantly just throw my money. Shut up and take my money. Uh, so as you can see, I'm an example. Uh, bleh, train of thought. I told you I wouldn't lose it, but I lost it. Uh, so, as you can see, he it's your heroes, and that's why these are so popular, Proto Mario, and all my viewers out there. So, uh, that's my explanation. They are basically the new generation of Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles and, uh, G.I. Joe, with and Transformers, which makes me think that they are extremely intelligent. So, do you agree with me? Uh, leave a like, a comment, maybe even subscribe to the actual Empire. That would be awesome. And go check out Proto Mario's channel. His original video will be in the description if I remember. I usually forget stuff like this because I'm not very good at remembering stuff most of the time. Uh, but go check out Proto Mario and his video. Pretty dang interesting. And until next time, I'm Max Lazuli from Max Lazuli Entertainment. And goodbye!